there are shocking seven deceptive way women use strange women use to destroy men this strange woman use this tightest to destroy men so if a man that wants to go into a relationship with a lady you have to know this seven titles or you're not in a relationship with a lady and a lady start exhibiting showing this ways showing this titles right you have to be extremely careful and watch your back i'm gonna list the seven titles they use number one is food a lot of men love food about almost all over the world whether your skin color is black white yellow brown they all love food as far as they are men men love food so much very good food yummy food healthy food so women know that men love food it's so difficult for a man to say no to a very well cooked meal so they use this titles to get you because they know you love food so you have to be careful as a king when a strange woman who before don't used to talk to you and start talking to you start cooking for you start bringing food for you to eat you have to be careful before you eat the food not it might be i've heard a case of somebody poison it might be somebody that sent her to give you food because they know that if maybe you, you are struggling with somebody and uh, maybe you are struggling with somebody or competing with somebody in the office about a promotion they can use a woman a strange woman to, to get to you or even a contract they can use a strange man to get to you through food she could start bringing food for you she can put love potion she can put poison so you have to be extremely careful before you take food from a woman. If she's not your girlfriend, she's not your wife, you are married, you have to be careful when you eat outside. If you happen to be with elderly people, one thing they advise men, do not eat any woman food. Unless you are ready to get married to this woman, do not eat their food because you also might end up getting married to somebody that you don't want to get married because she gave you something to eat. She cooked one delicious food and put something inside and you ate and you forget and you, you don't know yourself again. Anything she say, you say, yes, woman. Yes, ma. Yes, this one. You started doing like woman. So when you, when a woman, a strange woman, start giving you food, you have to learn to say no, that you don't want this food. Because whatever enter your stomach can kill you. Number two is true excessive care. You see, when a woman wants to get to a man, even when, you see, I have seen men say, I may have a girlfriend or I'm married. Most time, when a woman, yeah, when a woman, I remember one of, one of my pastor said, my pastor then said, if a woman say, I will deal with you, you have to be careful. You have to, because women can go, to, especially a strange woman, she can go to any length to bring down your, your 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 marriage she can come through excessive care she can even come through excessive care to get information are you talking about delilah and samson they want to get information where you get your power from so they will start with excessive care they will care for you especially when she used to mind her business all of a sudden she started showing excessive care or you don't know this woman from nowhere she becomes so she wants to, to get information for you she'll be asking are you okay oh is it your business is it your marriage oh what is the problem maybe she, she came for something you have to be careful you have to be up and doing you have to be at a lot because you don't know what is her motive when you tell her that you're not feeling fine she will say with you throughout the day and you that just started out of nowhere you are not dating. Even when you tell her, look at marriage, she, 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 she will always come to you at a vulnerable stage. She wants to get something. She's always asking you so to get information from you. You have to be careful. You have to be really careful so that you don't end up um, destroying yourself or you don't let her destroy you. So number three way a woman used to destroy men is through gifts when a woman starts giving you gifts maybe you're a colleague in your office you are not dating from nowhere you have been working with her for like five years six years and you will have nothing together and then she'll keep buying you your gifts one excessive gift she'll buy clothes she'll buy all those that kind of gifts even when you touch the gift you feel somehow you feel there's something strange about the gift right it's not everything you accept so when she makes it keep giving you there is something even if it's not spiritual, it's physical. There is reason why she wants to get to you. She'll start showing you uh, unnecessary care uh, and gift. Start gifting you things 
that you don't even need things that you don't want every day you come to the office she's giving you gifts so take this and then you'll be wondering why is this lady giving it's not everything you accept as a man you have to check it you have to be at a lot and protect your destiny and protect yourself physically and spiritually so when a woman start giving you excessive you know when a gift is so excessive maybe an elderly woman who want to you know you're married Maybe she wants you as a sugar a sugar boy. You see her buying you excessive car, buying you expensive things. Every time she's giving you a gift. And you know you don't want to do anything with this person, but you are not even talking to this person. You have to watch your back because if you keep collecting it, before you know it, you don't enter deep into that that you cannot say no when she comes. And before you know she will destroy your marriage, your happy home, and then you are gone, gone forever. So you have to be at a lot when a woman starts giving you excessive gifts that you do not ask for. Okay, number four way a woman can destroy a man is through visit. There are women that target you. You tell them, for example, you are in a serious relationship, they will not want to hear. Maybe they want to destroy that relationship because they want you. And you know you don't love her, but she wants you. And she doesn't love you, but she wants you. Maybe she wants to make her best friend. Maybe it's her best friend uh, guy. She wants to make her best friend angry and sad. She wants to snatch or she will do anything to have you. There are women that go to and they will visit you. They will clean for you. They will watch everything. They will clean. They will do that, do that. Look, they will go to any extreme. If you ask them every day, they're in your house cooking and cleaning, washing plates like herself. And when you give them money, they say, no, they don't want it. You know, adding all wife material because they have a traumatic to take you from their girlfriend. They are forcing themselves on you. They want to hook you. Not only that. The two visit can also be somebody send them to to even mount a camera or mount something that will implicate you. They want to put something that will implicate you. So only way they can get to you is through a woman because they know that maybe your enemy. They will send a woman to you. They know you love beautiful women. They will send the opposition her where you will see her. Then they will allow her. They will. They already know you're aware about but because they know that you you will not uh, trust them. So they need a woman, a beautiful, tall, beautiful yellow woman fair woman very tall you know so the woman that where you will see her then the next thing she's coming to your house every day she's coming to your house either she wants to get information she wants to mount something in your house but she's always visiting cleaning cleaning so there are so many stories where people allow people to come into their house strange women to come into their to clean and they don't know that they have motive they have something before you know it maybe she has something there's something she's targeting they send out to get information of how how much how rich you are where you keep your money how you keep your money where is the atm and all that she's you before you know you start trusting how oh, this one is very nice trust her with everything and before you know they have duped you she can plant something that will put you into trouble so constant visit from a strange woman out of nowhere she start visiting you clean and watching you have to be at allow open your eyes shine your eye and make sure that this is from a genuine place there's nothing wrong if a woman genuinely do those things and because she loves you but you as a man has to also be at a light so that you don't end up destroying yourself because this can destroy you when you do not shine your eye and guide yourself the five way a woman destroy men is through sex Free or show free, they will give you or show free. You'll be happy that they are giving you free. Hey, this woman only asked me for money. She will give you any time. Before you know it, maybe you are doing well in your business, everything is doing well, and before you know it, everything is shut down. And you wonder what is going on. You don't know it's because you have um and you you have something to do with a strange person out of nowhere. She will give you, she will be giving you. What of physically? You you just collect free or show free. You do not go for tests to know if she has disease and you she's giving you for free. You are taking and you are collecting. Before you know it, you end up with a uh, STD. Not every woman you see, you just you know pull up and do. Sometimes you say no. Do not allow a woman to offer you free. So whenever you come to free sex, say no. You don't want it. Especially when you become a consistent, like every time, every time she wants you people to do it, every time there is something. Because once she lock you up, hmm, she has locked you up. Oh. You see, 10 years before you are doing everything will just crumble. Or maybe you are okay, healthy and everything, before you fall sick. And then they will test, they will say, oh, you have HIV or something. So you have to be careful before you go into a relationship with somebody you meet, a strange woman that's willing to do it, even immediately you meet her, without free. Or show free you 
without anything. And you say, oh, this one is for you. Tomorrow you go again. Next tomorrow you go again. Every day you are going, you are sweeting you. You have to be at a last shy your eye so that you don't end up destroying or opening door for a woman to destroy you. Finally, another way a woman destroy a man is through blood components. You see, so men will just, women will trick you. Let's have blood components. Let's, let's be in a covenant. And you're not even sure if you're going to spend your rest of your life with this person, but you want to go into covenant with that blood one. You want to share your blood with her and she will force you to do it. Some men force women to do it, but most of the time women want to lock you up. You see, so before you do block, why would you even do block covenant when you don't even know what will happen tomorrow? So as a man, it's not even advisable to you for you to go into a block covenant with a woman or a woman to go block into a block covenant with you. So be careful when a woman first will ask you, oh, bring your blood, let's let's do no. Because anything can happen. So guys, kings, why you are out there searching for her, you know, to go into a healthy relationship, to get married to a healthy and have uh, to get married to a very good woman, beautiful woman, hardworking, a very intelligent woman. You have to also look out for a strange woman. Stay away from strange woman and know when to say no. When you know when to say no to food, no strange food, no know when to say no to free or to free sex, know when to say no to excessive gift and excessive care. I'm going to be seeing you again in my next video. Bye-bye.